Well, it was really, uh, what drew me to this was really Zhang Yimou, um, that I, I'd been chasing him for a long time, hoping that uh, there'd be a role available for me in, in one of his movies. Um, I just think he's such a brilliant director, and um, I've admired his work for a long time. And, um, and then, you know, I, I suddenly got this call that there was this, this um, project, and I went and I met him, and I looked at his drawings and everything that he wanted to do with it, and it's just so, the scale of it is so huge, and um, I just didn't want to pass up the chance to see him paint on that big a canvas. The, the conceit of the movie is that um, it's like a historical fantasy, so it's as if uh, we're in 1100 AD, and I, I play a mercenary along with Pedro Pascal, and we, we stumble across the, uh, upon the Great Wall, but the wall has actually been built in order to keep uh, these mythical Chinese monsters out of northern China. So they attack every 60 years, um, wave after wave of these monsters. So it reminds me of those kind of creature features from when I was a kid. And, uh, you know, you go to the theater to be scared by the monsters. And, uh, and uh, I think hopefully if we've done our job, then, then, then you know, young people will want to go see this and, and, uh, and be excited by the... The, you know, the Tao Te as they attack. Um, well, I've worked with a lot of legendary directors in my life. I've been really lucky that way. And, um, and I've found them all to be incredibly humble people. And really, uh, I think the thing that they all have in common, the great directors, is that they're really open to the ideas of the people around them. They really collaborate. Um, they always are very prepared, they always know exactly what they want to do and they have a plan, but they're willing to shift their plan a little bit um, de depending on what ideas become available to them. And so they kind of create a, an environment where ideas can come from anywhere um, and then they react to those ideas. And, um, and I just, he was just so fun to work with. It, um, you know, he'd, he'd listen to any suggestions that I'd make, and, you know, which isn't to say that he would take them, but he would always listen and, and, uh, and, and really consider them. And um, uh, it was just fun. Uh, it felt like a really healthy collaboration. I would describe it as a um, historical fantasy uh, with monsters in it um, that's, that's bigger than life. It, it really is the biggest movie I've ever been in. I mean, the scale and the scope of it is just so epic and massive. And, um, and who else would you want to direct that but Zhang Yimou? I mean, he really is the master of that, like, huge spectacle. Um, you know, and he's so great at choreographing large groups of people, um, you know, as he's done in the Olympics, as he's done, you know, in a lot of these live performances. But in this case, he was doing it live so that we could capture it in camera. But then there, there was this whole other element of CGI with these monsters. And so he was, he was staging battles that were incredibly intricate, and half, the, half the, uh, the fighters weren't even there. So he really was, I think, challenged and, uh, and did, a, did a beautiful job.